as you enter into active imagination, first you will want to find a quiet place where you will not be disturbed. Turn off any phones or anything else that might be distracting. Then settle yourself into a comfortable chair or couch, placing your feet flat on the floor with your legs uncrossed, with your hands either in the arms of the chair or couch, on your legs or in your lap. Next, since we will be inviting aspects of the unconscious to come into consciousness, you will first take your mind off of the external world and will turn your focus on the inner world, doing so by entering your imagination. So first you will want to quiet your body and your mind. Next, you will direct your inner eye to a place inside of you and then merely wait to see who or what will show up. It may take some time before anything happens. That's often the case when you're first beginning this. So you may need to be patient, staying with the image that you have chosen to begin with. When someone or something does arrive, invite them to begin the dialogue. And an important aspect of this is to respect the figures that arise treating them as you would something or someone in the outer world. For example, if something dangerous were to confront you, you in the outer world would likely respond with care. If you were walking on a beach and a tiger would show up in the outer world, you would likely feel some concern. You would not likely go up to it and pet it until you knew it was absolutely safe to do so. You would not do that in the outer world. Neither would you do it in the inner world. We are to treat what we meet as real, because it is real. Our minds control much of how we move through life. So imagination is a psychic reality just as the tiger in the outer world is a material reality. So once you have quieted your body and mind, then choose a symbolic place to visit. This will be the launching point of the imagination. Choose a place that has meaning and energy for you. It may be walking on a beach or within a forest. It may be within a glade in the forest. It may be a church, a jungle, a monastery cell, a mountain, a riverside, whatever calls to you. Once there, begin to explore, seeing who and what you meet there. Bring your whole self into this place by asking yourself about your feelings, your sensations, and your thoughts as you are moving about this place. It is these as well as a description of who you meet and your dialogue that you will want to bring into your psychotherapy session in order to further explore and to determine your inner and outer world response to this imagination. To merely have the imagination is not enough but to attend to it, and then to see what your response will be to it is what is of importance. Only do as much as you are comfortable with, never more. This should be hard work. So many people can do it only for 10 or 15 minutes at a time. That is fine. Try to limit it to no more than half an hour. Once you have entered your symbolic place, I will be saying no more. So end when you are ready. So let us begin by quieting the body and mind and then entering your symbolic place. 
Settle yourself now where you are seated. Close your eyes. Take a nice deep breath, breathing deep into your abdomen and feeling the breath come in and go out. Take another breath, feeling yourself quieting down as you're breathing. Take a third breath, letting it come in deeply and go out. Feel that your body is beginning to become quieter, more relaxed. Begin to imagine that a warm oil is being poured over the top of your head. Smooth, warm, comfortable oil. It's flowing down your scalp now. And as it does so, your scalp releases and relaxes. It's flowing over your forehead. You feel it relax, the wrinkles leaving it. Flows down over your closed eyes and you feel your eyes relax, all strain going from them. It flows over your ears, they relax. Your cheeks, your nose, your upper lip, all release their tension and relax. Your jaw relaxes does so maybe even your ears open up more, pop. The back of your neck is relaxing. The front of your neck relaxes. You feel the oil now flowing over your shoulders like a cave. As it does so, the warmth and the comfort make your shoulders drop and they relax. The oil is flowing down both arms, down to the elbow, the wrist, relaxing, flowing down your hands, warming them even as it touches them and envelops them, dripping off your fingers, your arms and your hands relax and are warm. The oil now spreads down to your upper back and your chest. You feel them release and relax. flows down your lower back and your stomach and abdomen. They release and relax. Tension goes from them. All you sense is your stomach going in and out as you breathe. It now runs down your hips, your pelvis, and your bottom. And they open up and relax. Flows down your legs, to your knees, down your calves and shins, to your ankles. flowing over all your foot to your toes. Your body is feeling very relaxed, warm, 
heavy. You turn your attention to your breath. Feeling the breath come into your nose. Watching it as it goes deep within you. Feeling it as the warm air comes out. You watch your breath come in and go out. You watch your breath come in and go out. In, out. As you breathe in, you feel comfort coming into your body. You breathe out, all tension goes. Now you bring your awareness into the place of your choosing. You take yourself now to your symbolic place. And you imagine yourself there. Look at the surroundings. If you've been here before, is there anything new? What are the sensations you feel here now? What is it that you see? What is the temperature? Now you are in your place. And you invite your unconscious to come forward. And you wait patiently. And you stay there until something does.